Hello everyone, and welcome to my sister wife's bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Star of Sister Wives Cody Brown has a history of dubious behavior. Three of the 55-year-old's four wives left after a string of issues stemming from his choice to move his family to Flagstaff. Many admirers also recall Cody's heartbreaking forgetfulness of his son Gabriel's birthday. It appears, though, that history repeats itself as Cody forgets yet another momentous day. The scene in which Gabriel sobbed because Cody had forgotten his birthday is among the saddest in the episode. On his big day, the sister wife star claims, his father called him. But Cody limited their conversation to their COVID-19 experience. To see if his dad remembered, Gabriel chose not to bring up his birthday during the phone conversation. Eh, uh, and he didn't, eh, uh, he said. The bond between Gabriel and Cody has soured since then, and it appears that the patriarch of the Brown family did it once more. On Reddit, a few sister wives followers are criticizing Cody for what appears to be a birthday insult to another of his kids. Michael T., renowned for her tight bond with her father, is the one. June 9th was her birthday. She recently said, though, that although her father had assured the family he would make sure birthdays were honored, he had not called. Some say that simply demonstrates how much Cody no longer loves his other kids, particularly after splitting from their mothers. The children are unimportant to Robin. Her own children are hardly given any thought, much less those of Janelle, Mary, or Christine. He has only Robin's children to answer to. They truly are a great match, selfish, slothful, entitled, narcissistic, etc. Ultimately, Cody is the only one he cares about. He has repeatedly demonstrated to viewers that throughout the years. Was this recently? I take it he doesn't get in touch with them even after losing a son? About their birthdays? Why this surprises me is beyond me. My heart aches for them. Tragically, these problems have been developing for decades, and not everyone learns from disaster. Some individuals intensify the poisonous actions that sparked the catastrophe. That's not surprising to me if that's the route Cody goes. It also looks like the kids are beginning to back off from their father. Fans of Sister Wives noted that Cody was not mentioned by the Brown family on Father's Day. As Mary and Janelle go about their business without making any mention of Cody Brown, Christine wrote a touching post with David on the important day. Some think that means the ex-wives and their kids have at last moved on from Cody, who is now married to Robin in a monogamous relationship. The Sister Wives family was rocked when Garrison Brown passed away more over three months ago. Gabriel, his brother, found his body. Their mother Janelle sent him since she felt things wasn't quite right. Tragically, by the time Gabriel got there, the 25-year-old had already died. Though Gabriel seemed to be the hardest hurt, the tragedy affected everyone in the family quite severely. Being of same age and having similar hobbies, the two brothers were close. They both had a tense connection with their father and bonded over defying Cody's stringent regulations during the COVID-19 epidemic. Gabriel has worried fans ever since Garrison passed away. What then is his current project? How is he handling the passing of Garrison? Learn all about it here. Cody and Garrison's tense relationship finally caused Janelle to break up with him. Family relations were never the same when Robin joined the family, as sister wives made clear. But the lockdown strained the brothers' relationship with their father even more. Since Gabe and Garrison would not abide by his guidelines to restrict their social lives, Cody declined to stay with Janelle during this period. Cody ordered Gabe to stop meeting his girlfriend, but Janelle stood for her children. Gabe and Cody appear to have not spoken since the lockdowns. On a Sister Wives episode from October 2022, Cody admitted he had forgotten Gabe was turning 20. But he did give his kid a call to discuss COVID-19. Gabe tested if Cody remembered by not mentioning it was his birthday. At last, Gabe decided to break up with Cody at this very moment. Currently 22 years old and a student at Northern Arizona University, Gabe was born on October 11, 2001. Gabe, for all his celebrity, strives to keep a low profile and hardly uses social media. With more than 67.9k Instagram followers, his most recent post was made on April 8, 2020. Gabe is pictured in the photo posing with his dog. Mom has always been keenly aware of Janelle. 
Before Garrison died too soon, she was even dubious about his mental health. The mother of six has been concentrating on raising her other kids since the tragedy. Given their strong relationship, Gabriel was naturally grieved by his brother's death. At his trying times, Janelle has been encouraging. Even if Gabe respects privacy in his personal life, he frequently shares pictures of himself with his loved ones. Viewers most recently caught him with Janelle and Savannah in Disneyland in Anaheim, California. Mickey D. I went to Disneyland quickly with Gabe and Savannah. I never want to pass on a chance to create memories, Janelle wrote in the caption. Also, he has been seen in Las Vegas, Nevada, hanging out with his pals. With time, Sister Wives will rank among TLC's longest-running series. Cody made his movie debut more than 10 years ago with his four wives. They were, until recently, really content with their multiple marriage arrangement. Christine quickly made the decision to split from her husband, and Janelle and Mary followed suit. Cody and Robin were negotiating the family fallout in the last season. Mary and Janelle, meantime, wondered what life would be like once they were divorced. Well, in a few months the new season of the show will probably end. Online chatter around the possible season 19 plot. The tale of Cody has left fans even more let down than before. With season 19 about to premiere, Sister Wives fans are more interested than ever. The family strife in earlier seasons resulted from the decisions made by Christine, Janelle, and Mary to leave. Cody and Robin however, sought for the family to be united, therefore all of this backfired. Still, it was inevitable given how they handled the other wives. Remarkably, they still refused to own up to it and blamed the other members of the group for leaving. There's a lot of excitement about Michael T's Patreon videos about fans getting to see Cody and Robin negotiate monogamy. The later was initially cool with her husband taking in extra wives. However, the polygamist concluded that he would be better off concentrating on his one and only relationship that lasted. As noticed by fans, Cody had suffered throughout the previous two seasons as well. It irritated the sister wives' devotees. That is so because for the previous two seasons, Cody has followed the same plot. After everything, he seems angry and depressed. Fans must feel enough sympathy for him though. They were therefore asking that starting in the following season, TLC concentrate on other cast members rather than him. This year, in January, Sister Wives viewers received a welcome surprise. Social media has already seen Christine brazenly promoting her new relationship with David Woolley. He starred in the recently released Tell All movie with her as well. In October of 2023, the pair also exchanged vows. TLC therefore made the decision to award them a special to highlight their nuptials. Fans will witness her mother start dating David in the next seasons, Michael T said. This is so because the material scheduled to air is almost two years old. Fans objected to this shift saying it was unnecessary to portray Christine in the courting stage with David when they already knew she had married him. Are the views of the fan base ones you share? What aspects of the family do you believe season 19 should address? Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.